my name is Case Kua Fisher. I'm a Kwandamuka Nunaka woman from Njeriba, North Shrebrooke Island, and also have connection to Yulu out near Kanamalaways. My connection to Broncos is I designed the jersey last year, which was exciting. So I'm proud to showcase my artwork on this year's jersey because it brings communities from everywhere together and acknowledges who we are and hopefully different cultures see themselves through the artwork and embrace our way of life and you know acknowledge we all have the same stories and same history and you know trying to gather together and push forward. To be a part of the Indigenous Round and to have a say in the jersey as well is it's amazing for myself and my family that I can say my story and uh, share my story with with the people here, the generation and, and the club. But, you know, it's been a dream of mine uh, since I was five years old when I learned how to play footy and um, I didn't want to do anything else but to play for the Brisbane Broncos and grew up around my Aboriginal side um, all my life and, you know, I'm very proud of where I'm from and who I am. The young leaders coming through, they're very culturally connected with mob and definitely gathering inspiration from them is put through the artwork. Having that connection to my family and my culture is very important to me and it gives me an identity and um, someone to play for. And um, Growing up I was raised to never to be ashamed of my culture and being on this big stage now playing NRL for the Brisbane Broncos, it just helps me um, promote my culture even more. It was amazing when uh, Casey first came on the scene about um, this idea about us players being involved to uh, design the jersey and it's never happened before and um, I think it's a great honour that we got to be able to sit down with her and share her artwork and you know she did a really amazing job in our first jerseys and uh, it showed on the field and yeah to be here again and uh, to share another design that she come up with and it's all about um, leaders and you know leadership at, at the club and it's amazing to be a part of. Uh, so the background is the colours of our land and seas and waters and it also represents our wind and they all have the calm and rough edges of every point of our country. So I've put the community links and the young leaders on the chest to represent the strength that we need to showcase and you know acknowledge who we are and the different communities that we all gather from and share knowledge and link through and also sharing that amongst different communities, whether it's Aboriginal, non-Indigenous, Torres Strait Islander, you know, Pacific Islanders, all gathering and coming together as one and acknowledging who we are. Uh, so I grew up with a lot of um, Torres Strait Islander mob down home in Logan, so having Ezra in the team as well is kind of like a connection that we had as well. And then showcasing their culture through the diary and the stars is really special and like privilege for me to actually showcase. Me not being Tosha Islander, I wouldn't, um, you know, use their pattern artwork. So having their Tosha Islander flag represented throughout is, is pretty special as well. You know, the, the headdress is very important in um, Torres Strait Islander culture. It's, um, you know, the symbol of all Torres Strait Islanders. Um, to see it displayed on the Broncos jersey, it's, um, you know, it means a lot to me as well. The boomerangs on the jersey represent sacrifice, courage, empowerment and strength. And that's for all of our people to bring us together and also acknowledge our past and our weapons that we used in battle and also for hunting and gathering. One of the boomerangs on um, the Indigenous jersey um, means sacrifice and for me that sort of hit home um, a little bit. You know, my mum uh, sacrificed a lot for me to be here and obviously me also as well, um, you know, leaving New Zealand at a young age by myself and moving over here with um, <laughs> sort of knowing no one and um, now that I'm here I'm, I'm very happy to be here and, and grateful and um, I can call everyone here um, my family. You know, we've got a, a good crew of um, young Indigenous boys here and you know, I know they're proud of their culture and um, it's pretty awesome to be able to you know, represent that and, and wear the jersey and you know, go out there and um, you know, inspire the, the young kids to hopefully get them to do the same one day. Yeah, growing up I idolised um, Greg Inglis. He was my idol growing up, you know, just the way he played on the field and also how he you know, carried himself off the field. You know, he'd done, 
done a lot for his mob and yeah, that's something I want to do when I grow up, yeah. You know, it's pretty special for me as well, being able to put on the you know, Indigenous jersey and being able to represent uh, who I am and you know, where I come from as well, yeah. It's pretty cool to you know, finally get in touch with that side of um, you know, my family and start to learn and you know, hopefully I can grow up and, and tell my daughter one day um, where she's from and stuff like that, so it's pretty cool. You know, hearing the boys' stories and um, all that sort of stuff, it's um, pretty inspiring and it's something that you know, I'm very excited to put on and um, wear come Indigenous Round.